Morning ladies, how are you? Yes, you're in control of your own life. Are you the driver of your life or are you the passenger? But what I know is that nearly 45% of trained salespeople, these are people who have been trained how to open a sale, ask great questions and how to close, 45% of them are afraid to ask for the sale. And you think to yourself, that's with somebody who actually has been trained in what to do. Ask yourself in your stores, how often are you seeing missed opportunities with your team? Just taught us today, it's just been so inspirational, so motivational and I just can't wait to get home and start implementing. <laughs> you must do it. I am a really busy mother of two and my biggest thing that I'm taking away from today is I now know how to leverage my time so that I can generate referrals while I am asleep or while I'm with my family. Okay to take imperfect action just to get started and also not to give and up. I want to talk to you today about how do you build a team of rock stars in your business. These are the people who are actually going beyond the call of duty, doing more than sales, more than service. They're what I call multipliers. And I think your biggest enemy is to do business as usual. If you keep doing business as usual, you're not going to get the growth that I know you guys want. Today. I did some mystery shopping in the last couple of weeks and spent some time on the shop floor. You know, and I've got to tell you, you can't wear heels like this. It's all about being flat and comfortable. So, customers want more. They're demanding more of our time. They want more resources. They want better product, better brand, better price. Your team are wanting more, uh, more money, more time off, more hours. There's a whole lot of more. 56% of all customer interactions in retail are all about customer service. It is that care factor, where only 25% is about the sales. Uh, so if you're looking for speaker training, you're looking for sales training, any type of anything to do with sales and communication, she is your number one person. I highly recommend Yvonne Hills. So product pusher is what often people associate when they think of sales and service. But I say, let's be customer centric. If you want to go, yeah, I'm going to spend all my money with you today. Do you go home and tell your friends and go, oh my God, you've so got to go to that store. Phenomenal, they push product on your left, right and centre. Maybe it is that you're living under the expectation of what other people think you should be doing. You know, I went for years under the, under the expectation of what I should be doing. You're better than you think. Start living into it now. How do you know that this rock star, who we're all going, yay, you're a rock star. But how do we know that this rock star is not actually a mega rock star? and they're just needing that nurturing, that bit of encouragement to actually go to their next level. But because they're often standing so far ahead of the pack, everyone's like, oh, no, leave them. We don't want to tamper with what's already working. And you go, wow, we've just done more than just deliver great sales and service. You know, your teams, your area managers, your team managers, your store managers, your part-time casuals who are working short shifts at the end of the week. Yeah. But your team have the ability to do that extra more moment on every transaction with your customers. So don't pass up this opportunity because she will drastically change the way you perform.